Morning. It's about 11 o'clock on Saturday morning, the 6th of December, and we're off to rescue as many turkeys as we can. Um, I've just emptied the car of all the bread um, I collect each day from Sainsbury's. Um, obviously, this is something I do um, every day in my lunch hour at work or after work. Um, that's quite a big ask, actually, because it takes about an hour to collect it all and unwrap it all. Um, and I've emptied the car out, obviously, and I've put a blanket down and um, so I'm just about to drive off to the turkey farm to um, see what we shall see. Right, well we've, we're in the car now on the way back. Um, I can't even... I can't even begin to describe uh, what's happened to the rest of the birds. They're all still there. Um, there were four injured ones, um, which I've got in the back of the car now. I don't know if I'm holding the camera at the right angle, but um, we're going back to the sanctuary now to look after their wounds and um, everything else. So. Well, we're back at the sanctuary now. Um, here are the four guys in the back of the car. Um, you can see that one's got a nasty wound there. Um, that one's a very big one. Um, this one's got some wounds on her neck and a nasty big one over there by the looks of it. I'll get them out and um, see how they are. They'll go in. They'll go into one of the enclosures down the bottom. Um, which is normally kept open, but I'll shut the door on it for a few days just to keep them in, to monitor them, see how they are. And uh, Snow White is already down there waiting for them. Uh, Snow White was one from two years ago, he didn't get any last year, because they'd killed them all by the time I got there last year. Um, so anyway, I'll get them out of the car now and um, see how they are. Right, I've got them all down the stables. Um, they're listening to Radio 3. Um, some song cycle or something. Um, here they are in their area. Now that's Snow White from two years ago. Gobbles is um, not sure where Gobbles is. She's probably in that little hutch over there, the little box. She sleeps in there a lot of the time. Um, here they are. So there's four of them here. Um, haven't got names for them yet, so we'll come up with names later. Although I think that little tiny one is going to be called Tiny for some reason. Um, oh, here comes some ducks. Check them out. So they've obviously done some checking out there. There's another hen there. So right, you're safe now, guys. So, um, that's four, four, four rescues. I'm hoping there's going to be some more, actually, but obviously there wasn't. Um, the first shed I accidentally walked into had all the others in it hanging up with a big dryer unit. And then... Um, there was a, a killing shed where there was just a mass of blood and feathers being swept up into a digger. <laughs> anyway, we're grateful for them to let us have these four, otherwise these four would be in there. Um, £20 each, we have to pay for them. So if you can help, because obviously that's on top of the 8000 we have to find every month to feed all this lot. Obviously this is only a few horses, and I haven't done the scraping down yet. Um, drop the phone then. But um, if you can help us, um, we're really, really struggling with membership. Membership is down another 10 in November. Uh, less than 290 people are members of the sanctuary now. So um, if you can help by joining, just for a pound a month, um, that will qualify you as a member. Um, please get in touch. Thank you.